Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I am back with finally a Black Friday haul. Um, this is from Ulta. I don't share this very often because I'm a big Mary Kay user, but I took my youngest in there for Black Friday and we were able to find some really good buys and I just thought I would share them with you. So, I have two little bags here so you'll have to bear with me. So, here is Ulta. Okay. So, the first thing I bought was a kit, a pedicure set kit. I have given up my manicures, my pedicures. I may go get one pedicure to get my feet in good shape, but I decided that because my nails were in such bad shape from the dipping, um, I really needed one of these blocks, and I just thought this was a really good kit. Um, when you have dipped nails, they don't push back your cuticles, they don't do all kinds of things. Um, what they really do is they file down your nail, at least the people who did mine. So, um, I think this is a pretty good kit. Now, I don't use the, um, emery boards, but I will use that in crafting. And I will use the little toe separators, because I haven't had those in years. I mean, I only get my toenails done like three or four times a year. I really don't, they don't grow that often. I, I have really weird nails and hair and all that. And I even take all this stuff, like, you know, all this stuff that's supposed to help your nails and hair and all that good stuff. But, um, yeah. And so, you know, I'm cheap. I'm cheap. <laughs> so, anyways, I'll make go when I need to. I also picked up some of this tart. It was on sale. And this is supposed to be, like, one of the best um, under-eye concealer brands. So, I wanted to try it. also came with little lashes. Um, I think that is just a little mascara. Um, I think so. But, um, anyways, they had samples. I put a little bit on my hand, and I could not believe how much it actually covered. So, I thought that was really neat. I picked up some of these. Um, my hands were so dry that weekend. I had, yeah, okay, I picked up that one and that one. And I thought I picked up one more. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Um, hmm. I guess we only picked up two, but these were on sale. This one is, they're both um, lavender and pink peony. I literally, my hands hurt 24-7, so CBD oil is, I know it's it's a real controversial thing. It is, even within our house, it's controversial, but this is not the hallucinogenic, you know, hemp oil. So, I mean, we eat hemp hearts. We, you know, I mean, there's a lot of good things in the plant. God created that plant. You know, there's good things in it. So, um, I am going to give that a whirl, and I'm going to keep one in my purse because it's winter, and my, my, uh, my hands hurt a lot. I also picked up, because I decided, right before I did all this, I decided to take my nails, <clears throat> pardon me, my nails off, and I just decided that I would give it all a try. I found one of my old nail polishes, and that's what I'm wearing now, and, and I mean, I cannot keep the nail polish on. My nails are so fragile and brittle, and it's just awful, but um, it will just be a season of re-strengthening them. So I really loved the Sally Hansen years ago, and I found a little glittery one, and I even found like a white glittery old one I had, but my youngest found this, and I thought, ooh, yeah, let's get that a try, and then just a regular pink cream, and then a strengthening, and a strengthening, and this one is a hardener, and this is a top coat. So I figured I'd put that one on, one of the colors, and then that. So, yeah, you know. You know, we try. Okay, I also picked up, because she found this one too, this was kind of like a rose gold. It is rose gold. So, I had to pick up that one too, just, just because. And then let me see if that was it. Because she was, oh no, I found this one too. The, she found, I think she found these two right here. And she may have found all three of those. But, um, I will put that on maybe Christmas Day. I don't know. But we'll see. At least I might put that on my toes. So, um... Okay, so there's that. I got all the nail stuff. And then, I'm trying to see if there's any more nail stuff in hands. I don't think there is. Okay. Let's see here. Now, I think I'm going to switch. I did do a little bit of the makeup, but that's okay. Okay, so I'm going to do some of the skin stuff. So I got a Brighter Than Diamond Hydrating Holographic Peel Mask. I don't know why. I just, I think it was one of those dollar deals and I grabbed it. Um, my face is so dry. It's horrible. 
And I also, oh, whoops, and I totally forgot. I also picked up that for nails. These are the best nail pads for when you travel to remove nail polish. I also picked up that for my hair. I love this brand. It is great. I have used it for a long time. Um, it's really, really good stuff, and it is great for your hair. Um, hold on. I'm trying to quit making all this noise. I'm sorry. Um, I picked up then the rest of the hair is, I think, yeah, I can just do this. Um, so, sorry about the name. I apologize. But it's really good hairspray. <laughs> so, one of them is a root, a root pump plus. So, you know, if you're from Texas, you like your hair big and fluffy and all that kind of good stuff. And so, um, my hair, as I age, becomes more and more fine. And I don't perm it anymore. And so, as a result, I need something to poof it up. So, I got this for the for the roots. And I got this. Um, it's just a volumizing hairspray. So, um, I really love these. They could both. It, this is a volumizing spray mousse. This one, the Root Pump Plus. And then this is a hairspray. So, I thought this was worth it. These were, like, I think they were $10. They were half price, essentially. So, um, it was a really good deal. So, I got those two because my daughter was like, well, get both. And I said, okay. <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. Oh, and I did get, I did get that one. Sorry. I did have one more. Man, I, and this was my youngest got that one for me, too. So, um, she was so sweet about it. But honestly, what I spent here on my nails alone with this, that doesn't even begin to cost what it cost to get my nails done once. Yeah, because it was Black Friday. I got had all these coupons and sales and everything. But, um, yeah, now it's just a matter of getting my nails back. So, anyway. So, okay. Back to show you some of the makeup hauls. So, they had again... Oh, whoops, I'm sorry. I had one more thing for hair. That is just a replenishing shine hair oil, which you put on, and I think you leave it on. I don't think this is like a deep, uh, like a deep treatment. Um, hold on. Yeah, I think this is one you just leave in your hair. It strengthens and restores. So, yeah. Okay. So, back to the makeup. Um, we don't need a lot of makeup because of our Mary Kay connection. And, um, but... They have the, like, um, five for a dollar. So I picked up one of those and one of those and one of these, which is the same one. And I think my youngest is going to take that one and put it in her stocking. I also picked up a pencil sharpener, which these are always great. I mean, it sometimes you have pencil sharpeners too long for your makeup, guys. Throw them away. Um, after a season, I really keep them about a year, and then I just wait for the next sale because... Unless you're really deep cleaning those, uh, and it's really hard to get up in there and clean them, um, you don't want bacteria and things like that to grow. You just want, you know, I, I even talked to my daughter um, a couple of days ago about, you know, you can only keep your makeup so long, and then you have to switch it out because it can have bacteria and all kinds of gunky stuff growing. And she's like, no, I didn't know. And so, anyways, and I bought my youngest, my daughter-in-law and I, and I will give this to my oldest, um, these were just dollar lip crayons. There was a bright pink one, and it was so stinking bad. It was horrible. It was. Uh, it's great for under your lipstick because it it'll last there all day. But my my daughter was like, "Mommy, have you looked in the mirror?" And I was like, "No," because we were out Black Friday shopping Black Friday that night. Um, and I was like, no. And she goes, you might want to look in the mirror. And I did. I was like, I was in the middle of Walmart with the Black Friday shopping. And we were looking at videos. They had the video bins. And I was like, woo, woo. And so I pulled another lipstick. I had my purse out and put it on. And she goes, yeah, that's much better, mommy. So anyways, she was so cute. So these are two eyeliners. She bought these. These will go in her stocking, my youngest. Um, she is... All, all my girls are beautiful. My daughter-in-law, my, my two daughters. Um, this particular daughter is, um, is was born in China, and so her eye makeup is a little bit different, and she has really been playing with a little bit of a cat eye. She doesn't do a lot of makeup. She's very subtle. But um, when she said, I saw, have you ever done a liquid liner cat eye? And she was like no and I said well you might enjoy it you might give it a try so she found those they were very inexpensive and yeah it was totally fine and then we also picked up some of these these were the bare minerals minerals must have um this is not I'm going to give this to my daughter-in-law I think she would enjoy that 
Um, I wanted these three. And for the price, you couldn't even buy them for that. So that's why I did that. But I'll give that to my daughter-in-law. And then, because um, those I love, like when I travel, they're perfect. And then these two, uh, matte on the double. So these are going to be matte lip glosses, which most... I, I don't know that anybody loves these yet, but these are great. You put a little bit of what's called a lip primer on underneath. You put this on top, and then I always use a liner to hold in the color because if not, it can run. And then I always put something on top of that, like a gloss or a lipstick that's creamier because usually these are not comfortable because they're too matted. They People feel like they dry out their lips. So there's a way to use them to where they're effective. They last a long time. It doesn't fade. It's all that and more. So um, either that or I'm going to give one to each one of my um, my daughter and, and uh, daughter-in-law. I'm not sure. But the colors were Dusty Pink Beige and Raisin. So I just thought those were fun colors. So And that kind of matched some of this. And, you know, some of this I'll give away. Some of this will keep. But, you know, mainly the hair stuff and the nails is mine. The rest is going to probably go to my other kiddos. Except for I will keep those three for sure because those will travel well. So, all right, my friends, that's it. Nothing major, just a lot of fun little things. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like I've, I think my youngest must have taken some of the stuff out that I got for her, and that's totally fine, because she should take it out. Um, but it, if you're going to go, go with coupons. I had my coupons. I used the Black Friday sales. I used the, you know, buy one, get one, you know, $1 piece, buy a piece thing, um, you know, you look for the good deals. These were on sale. That's the only reason. I, I think it was buy one, get one, or buy one, get one half off. Um, these were part of the Black Friday sales. This was 15 This was 12 These are the buy one, get one for, you know, a dollar a piece for 5 And then um, all the nail things. Um, all the Sally Hansen was discounted. All of the hair was either flat out on sale or discounted. And then um, this was probably the only thing, and this was a Black Friday find as well, so that was a kit and that was on sale. And then this was probably the only thing that I didn't buy that was discount, discounted and this. So, and those were like, you know, a couple of dollars each. They were not very expensive at all. So, you know, and that I had my Ulta discount, you know, coupon. So, I mean, I feel like I did pretty well and I think that everything was kind of done. And for me, um, like I said, giving up, the mani petties is a really good thing and I can just do my own and I can save a lot of money which I did for years even my husband said he said you always did your nails and they were so cute and I was like okay well you you at one point didn't want me to stop and now you want me to stop and he goes well I just want you to do what you would enjoy and I think he's right I think that the time out the upkeep the whole thing I loved how beautiful the nails looked but um it's just time to take better care of myself eat healthier smoothie more all that kind of good stuff and that's a big part of the reason why I'm willing to change because I know that that part of my life is changing and um, you know when we get healthy our hair and our nails they reflect it so but we still have to take care of them all right friends I hope this encouraged you because I know many of you um, you guys write me that you don't do things to encourage yourself okay out of everything here go get an inexpensive mask this is the Ulta brand Go get a hair mask. If this is a face mask. Go get a hair mask. Whatever's on sale. And if that's all you did, and you put some really good lotion on your hands, and put some socks over them, and let those kind of go, and you can do the same thing to your feet, you're done. That would be a blessing beyond all words. And I think that sometimes we just need to do that for ourselves. We need to take a few minutes and take care of ourselves. I am pointing every bit back at me because I don't do that. And I want to encourage y'all to learn from all my mistakes and take good care of you because I love you guys and I want the best for y'all. Okay, friends, um, I pray your day's blessed, creative, and lovely. I hope this encouraged you. Um, let me know in the comments what you do that may be inexpensive to encourage yourself. So, I mean, you could even use coconut oil. You can use olive oil. You can use anything. You do not have to have an official mask, okay? Um... Yeah, and sometimes that just gets me started. Does that make sense? So, yeah. Because I use coconut oil when I get out of the shower. I'm just so dry right now. I mean, I just, I'm so dry. It's just horrible. So, anyways. All right, friends, I'm going to let you go. I pray your day's blessed, creative, and lovely. Um, leave a comment. Let me know which you use 
to, uh, and, you know, to take care of yourself. And I'm not even going to use the word pamper, but just to take good care of yourself. I'd love to, you encourage me because it, maybe I'll learn from you and I would love that. I need to learn all these things again. I, uh, I've been too busy. All right, my friends. Um, I'm going to let you go. I'll be talking to y'all soon. Love you. Bye-bye.